Hello, everyone. My name is Yongwan Lim. Today, I will be presenting our recent work on deep learning for spiral real time MRI using convolutional neural networks. Real time MRI is one of the emerging technologies in MRI that is used to study movement, such as in vocal tract, heart, and joint. One interesting application is speech imaging, where the vocal organs, such as tongue, lips, and bilum can be imaged during unnatural speech production. For this technique to be able to capture such a rapid motion, it is most desirable to keep scan efficiency as high as possible. In this sense, spiral sampling is one of the widely used techniques in this domain. However, a fundamental limitation of spiral real-time MRI is that it suffers from spatially bearing blur that is based on special variations in the magnetic field. This blurring is spatially bearing, and you can see that it is most severe at the articulator boundaries. In the speech application, this is the exact location of research interests, and this type of artifact can cause error in any linguistic analysis made on this type of images. Um, several deep learning methods exist, and most of them involve two general procedures. First is a field map acquisition, and the second one is spatially varying the convolution. Uh, the field map here is a special map that contains information about the source of learning which is essential for resolving this type of artifact, whereas the acquisition of this field map often reduces the scan efficiency. And given the blurry image and the field map, the deconvolution procedure is usually performed, but is typically computationally, computationally slow. So these two types of limitations are not desirable for real-time MRI applications, whereas high scan efficiency and low latency processings are uh, crucial. Therefore, in this work, we propose a supervised learning method that utilizes a compactly layered CNN architecture. Once it is trained, it does not require explicit knowledge of the field map and can perform the deep learning within a few milliseconds. The proposed method uh, follows this. We first generate a sharp images using a previously proposed method. Then we take these sharp images and field map as our ground truth and generate several uh, blurring based on MRI physics and some data augmentation strategies. We then train the architecture using the training data generated from 23 subjects. And in test time, we perform deep blurring for new blurry input in an end-to-end -end manner. Here is an example of the deep learning result on synthetic test data. Uh, first of all, you can see in the uncorrected images, severe blurring in different regions. And this is an e extreme example, which we choose to showcase the power of this technique. And we apply different existing methods to this test data. The proposed CNN method successfully resolved the blurring artifact in most regions and achieve visually comparable leader to an ideal reconstruction method that is based on the ground truth field map. And if you take a look at the UIT plot, the proposed method exhibits sharp boundary between uh, tongue and air, as well as around the hot soft palate. And this is uh, found to be uh, constant over time. We then apply the existing and proposed methods to the real test data where the, the blurring is much severe, but the ground truth field map is not available. So we can see that the proposed methods still provide improved delineation of the boundary, whereas the previous method doesn't. To sum up, we develop a CNN-based deep learning method for, for spiral real-time MRI in speech production application. It is field map free and effective at resolving spatially bearing blur at the articulator boundaries. It is also extremely fast with negligible impact on latency or workflow for real-time MRI applications. Um, thank you for your attention and please contact me if you have any questions. Thank you.